Hey, welcome back guys. We've all been there, you've forgotten your password and you don't know the answers to your security questions. Well, this simple guide will show you how to recover your password within Windows 11. So the first thing I want to say is that this will not work for Microsoft Online accounts. You'll need to reset those accounts on their website. This password recovery procedure will only work for the local accounts. So I find myself at the Windows login prompt and as you can see, I've forgotten my password. So the first thing we need to do is hold down the shift key, go down to the bottom right, left click, while holding shift, click on restart. Once you've done that, you can let go of the shift key and it will boot into the Windows boot options. From there, we click on Troubleshoot. We click on Advanced Options. Click on Command Prompt. In here, we need to type in C colon, then CD Windows backslash system 32. So then here, we're going to rename utilman.exe. but we're going to put a one or any anything after it basically is going to be fine because we just need to make sure it's not the same name okay we're then going to rename the cmd.exe to utilman.exe and then from there we're going to type in exit Click on continue and this will boot us back into the login prompt. Once in here, just click and the accessibility option is now actually because we've renamed it is going to bring up, bring up the command prompt instead and from here we need to type in control user passwords to this will then bring up the user accounts dialog box where we can reset the password for the account if you have more than one local account make sure you you reset in the, the correct one by highlighting it. So click on reset password, type in a password, click OK, click OK again, type in exit, and then log in with this uh, new password that you've just changed it to. And you'll see uh, we're back in which is great now one of the main problems now is that because we have ultimately renamed the CMD file we need to change it back otherwise we're never going to be able to access it again unless you want to use the word utilman so as you can see utilman is now the command prompt so we need to rectify that and to do that we need to sign back out We'll need to do the same procedure as before to get to the Windows boot menu. Hold down the shift key, click on the power button down the bottom right, click on restart. Once you've clicked on restart you can let go of the shift key.
once we're in the boot menu click on troubleshoot click on advanced options go to command prompt here type in C colon press enter type in CD stands for change directory and we're going to go to the windows backslash system 32 folder and we're going to do the renaming in reverse in order to rectify that issue with the accessibility in the command prompt so ren for rename utilman.exe back to cmd.exe and then ren utilman one dot exe to utilman dot exe type in exit and press enter click on continue this will take us back into the login prompt where we can then verify that both the accessibility menu and the command prompt are back as they were So if we click down at the accessibility, we can now see it's no longer coming up with a command prompt. And if we log in, we can verify the command prompt is back as, as it was. So click in the search box and type in CMD. It should now find it. Click it to verify it actually loads the prompt. And as long as it does, uh, we're good. So thanks for watching. I hope you find this one useful. Please like, comment or subscribe to help me grow the channel. And I will see you in the next video.